Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. It's Theoni with Thrifty Divas. It's super early. I just woke up a little while ago, so I'm still puffy. Um, but I wanted to get two thrift store hauls filmed today. So you will see another one, probably, hopefully, if my plans work out just like this here, just like this. So the first haul that we're doing in this video is a savers haul. And then in the next video, it's going to be kind of collective of the church and the barn and a little bit from the hospital thrift store as well. Um, if you're local in that video, I'll run through which ones again, but most of you know if you're local. So anyway, all right, so let's get started with this savers haul. So the first thing I picked up from Savers was this Western Premium Barbecue Products Prime Cedar Grilling Planks. And this was $1.99 and I picked this up for my parents. Actually, they still grill now. I was going to say for the summer, but they still grill now. So they like to do salmon on these particularly. And it's a two pack and it was $1.99 and that's a good price. So I got that to give to them. The next thing I picked up was this for $1.29 another one you're not having deja vu i found one last time at savers as well in the harvest gold this one happens to be in the almond this is the tupperware deviled egg keeper all pieces are in there so it looks just like that on the inside and yeah so now I have one in almond as well. We are going to have some bags to go through that are kind of exciting, I think. Hopefully, we'll see. I don't know. But um, the next thing I grabbed is this. There's the remnants of a little fortune off sticker on there. But it is this wood little rack. Um, I was thinking for sales, either garage sales or at the antique mall if we get the outdoor space in the spring etc i thought this was just good to hang bracelets on and things of that nature and it was a dollar 99 and i thought it was worth every penny so i grabbed that next i picked up this sands of time lucite shell clock now i have not tested it yet i have not put a battery in it to test it i paid 3.99 for it um i think i will probably list this on ebay for a little while and if it doesn't sell oh i'll list it only if it works obviously but if it doesn't sell um i'm totally gonna keep that because i'm obsessed with it anyway so maybe i'll list it we'll see what happens <laughs> all right next i got this um rubbermaid in the like harvest gold color little pitcher and it was a dollar 49 and then I got, the bottom is like coming apart. Um, this was $2.99. I don't know if I can show it to you. <laughs> $2.99. And it is this vanity, you know, dresser mirror. Absolutely beautiful. Definitely has some age to it. And uh, that's from me. That's for my dresser. And next, this was $7.99. And it is this gorgeous, oh, come on, son. This gorgeous suitcase. So I am going to work. This is leather, and the handle is leather. Um, obviously, there's no keys. It's in pretty good shape. It's got some scratches there, but I feel like with um, a mild conditioner, they could definitely get mellower. And this, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, is from the 40s, maybe 50s. Um, works like a charm. It says made in the USA. And um, it's got a blue satin interior and then here you know you just tie them they didn't have clips back then and it's got this for the upper section so that I thought was absolutely am amazing it does need to air out 
I'm gonna leave it open and I'm gonna um, let the sun hit it outside. The next thing I got for $1.49 is this Crown Corning Thermique made in Japan pink coffee carafe thermos. So this will be listed as, as much as it pains me because I really like this one. I really do, um, but I will be listing that. I just loved it. I love the pink and I think a lot of other people will as well. So yes. Uh, next, this will also be listed. This is brand new in box Batman ice cube tray, silicone ice cube tray, and it was $1.99. Um, but I am going to list that. Then I got this for listing as well. So this says copyright Lego. This was $2.99. Hold on. Oh no, it took the sticker off. Hold on. Oh, sheesh. Goodness. Okay. So I had to take the sticker off, the price off while trying to save this and it did lift it on the side, but it says fine quality Lego Japan. If you can see that. $2.99. It still has the paper tag on there. Moody Mary. Japan. Moody Mary, a girl of many moods. I am I when I'm empty. I want to cry. Fill me up and I'll be gay. Isn't it nice to be that way? So there's something in there. I wonder if there's a coin in there. <laughs> I can't get it out. I don't know. There's a penny. There's a penny in there. Um, but it's got this like bluish straw hair and you turn it around and it's got this is from the 60s and it's got all these different moods on there it's so cute oh my goodness so this one says i am bored today i am furious today i am sad today that came off a little bit i am happy today so yes i got that for listing um, then I don't know why I just like it <laughs> and there's only one I wish there was two but there wasn't but I can keep my eye out for another one so this is just this milk glass so I, apparently this was like at a garage sale or something for three and then Savers was like yeah we'll go with that <laughs> so $2.99 um, it is unmarked I mean I could look it up I'll probably figure it out from that pattern but it's just a single candlestick and I did pay $2.99 for that. And then I did pay $3.99 for this, but I never ever find them with lids. So I was very excited. This is glass bake made in the USA. And it's just this white little casserole dish with the glass top. So I thought that was a really good find. Oh my goodness. Then also for listing, I found this hand-painted Japanese lusterware little dish. So it says made in Japan right there. It was $1.99 and I did get that for listing as well. Then I found this. I've never found this before either. This is a little Pyrex tableware. And it's in this little avocado green. And it's this little ramekin. That was $1.99. I thought that was amazing. That will probably stay with me. Then I found this. I thought I got this for listing as well. I This might go better like towards Christmas, but it was a dollar ninety nine and it is Lando Lakes butter cookie kit. It's got like a little uh metal sticker there. I think this is 70s. So it has all of these awesome copper cutters in there. So it has the 12 cutters that came with the set and actually, I'm looking at it now. It's got a turkey. It's got a, a bunny, I think it was. So it might be good anytime. So it's got the 12 original that came. And then this one doesn't belong, this little guy. 
and this says made in Hong Kong. So this also had come with a butter cookie recipe originally, and I believe the um the like press, the metal cookie press tube, uh, and some tips for that. But this is only the 12 cutters and the original box, so that's for listing. Next, I got this planter for a dollar ninety-nine. This will be listed as well. So there is a foil sticker on there also, and it says National Potteries, Cleveland, made in Japan, hand painted 1962 Napco, Bedford, Ohio, rainbow trout. So this is a 1962 rainbow trout planter with these dusty, dusty little plastic foliage in it. It's got a couple of little cracks, but I have a hard time finding anything cool. So I thought this was amazing and I will be listing this as well. All right, next I picked this up because um, I was happy to find this for only $1.49, this little um, fish tank thing. And it's a little sunken pirate ship. So I got that for little man to keep. Um, I don't know if he wants to use it now. I, if you watch my other videos, we got uh, him a SpongeBob pineapple house, which he wanted. But for the next go round or whatever, I just got that. Because $1.49, I was like, yes. Because you know those things can get expensive. All right. I think the only thing left is um, bags. So let's take a look at this one. I had to save this one. I did a lot of rescue missions here, I feel like. So $3.99 for this in a bag. And I was like, no, I can't, I can't. It's like so sad I, I, to watch them all be destroyed in there, you know? So it is this one, two, three, one, two, three, four. There are five in here. All of them have their original little cork at the bottom, except for one. But these will be listed. So these are Japan, these little spice jars, hand-painted with roosters on them. So we have nutmeg, clove. The clove is the one missing. It's a little cork. Yeah, it's gone. Cinnamon, sage, and the last one is allspice. So those for $3.99. This next bag was $2.99 and there was one particular thing, well it's two, it's a set, that was catching my eye for $2.99 and then like I always tell you, everything else is bonus. All right, so the first one is that, oh, is this Dalmatian without a foot? So there's that, okay. And it's not in the bag. And then this is a little hobbyist piece. It was these. So for $2.99, this was almost, this was another rescue mission of sorts because I was like, oh, oh no. So look at these, please tell me anything you know as, as always. So they're two of the same of these gorgeous Mary and Jesus. I think they're little wall hangers. Looks like one of the wall hangers has been replaced. The, the hook has been replaced with just some wire, but that looks more original and the I don't know they just looked old to me hopefully I wasn't wrong on that but and there are no chips and I wanted to keep it that way so I rescued them and I don't know if this is going to pick up on camera with the glare but there is crazing can you see that there I don't know but all along here there's a good bit of crazing, which just makes me think that they're old. Um, I don't know. But please let me know anything you know.
So $2.99 for that, essentially. This next bag was $3.99 and a major rescue mission. I hope I'm not too late. Can you? All right, let's take a look. I wasn't late. Oh my goodness. There, there's no, there's no chips. This is a little left in piece of this beautiful frilly rose or whatever that is, frilly flower on a little log. I had to get it out of there. I, I had, to, I just had to. So, whew, I can't believe this thing isn't chipped as delicate as it is. So there's that. Remember, $3.99. The other thing that had to be rescued, stat, was this glass, I don't know if it's crystal or glass, but this swan with the hand-painted gold on there. Can you believe this is not chipped either? Look at that beak. Look at the delicacy of that beak. And it's not, it's not chipped, but it's got the gold painting on there and those little tiny leaf tips on the bottom, I had to save this. So still in that $3.99 with the, with the Lefton flower, as well as, are you guys ready? This is like crazy. I think I'm like going in level of craziness that these things weren't, didn't meet their doom. Look at this little hummingbird on this rose. No chips. I can you believe it. Oh my goodness. Okay, so that's that. Then in the same bag is this little acrylic, little praying angel. Um, it does say China embossed on it, so. And then we have this little Easter bunny. No, I don't know, not Easter, just a bunny riding a toy horse with a gold heart that says Baby's First Christmas 2005 made in China. And then we have one of these. I feel like that that's like homemade, like one of those clay ones. I don't know, this little snowman. We have this little ceramic house. I feel like that's just a little hobbyist piece as well. This I feel is an actual cookie which is also a miracle, it didn't break. And that is crazy. And another hobbyist piece, which wasn't so lucky because that was broken and reattached. And then we have this. Um, it, it feels almost like dense paper mache. I, I don't really know, um, but it's this little mouse and she's got like a, a wooden tail or like a raffia tail so it's a really big ornament and she's holding her little dolly there are no marks on it let me know anything you know if she's like from somewhere or i don't know and the last thing in that 3.99 bag is this little hugger squeezer thingy it says happy holidays and it does say made in korea on the sticker and do you guys remember these i do and you squeeze his little arms there and he can clip onto something. So he's adorable. So all of that for $3.99. The son was like, hey, Theoni's filming, we were late, let's go. <laughs> and the last bag, also $3.99, major rescue mission here as well. But I saw a bunch of Lefton stickers and I was like, ah, made me very nervous. And the other thing that was in there, ready for this, check this out. I cannot believe these aren't broken either. So this was, a, as little berries fall off, this was a major part of the rescue mission as well. These say made in Japan on that sticker and they are little candle stick holders. And there's little holly and stuff painted on it. And there's gold accents. <sighs> Saving old things one trip at a time. <laughs> All right, then let's see. 
All right, so we have this 1989 Department 56 little lamp post. This says 1988 GZL. Now I thought maybe what the guy's holding is broken, but it is painted on top and bottom, so I don't think it's broken, the stick. Then we have this ladder, this plastic ladder that fell off of something, let's see. This is a 1989 Lefton, oh, there you go, GZL, That's so this guy's Lefton also. We have a little firefighter ceramic. This is a little plastic village figure. I don't know if that's old or not. It looks pretty old. Another little kid. Another little kid that fell on his butt ice skating. So those are plastic ones. I'll keep the plastic ones together. There's a little girl. Oh, it's like a little mother and son skating. And there's a little plastic bench with a spot of glue on there. I don't, I guess some, oh wait, hold on. These guys, it looks like, there we go. These, are these plastic? Okay, these are plastic. So these are gonna go with the other plastic people. There we go. Okay, so all of those plastic people. And now ceramics, more of the left end stuff. So this is 1987. This has been repaired though. At the foot, it's been glued on. This left in 1986. Um, this is not marked, but it is ceramic. This is also not marked, but I think I found what happens with our ladder. So that guy goes on the ladder somewhere and he's ceramic. Then we have this, which says KSA. So that is Kurt Adler, the ceramic bridge, decorated bridge. And this is a 1987 Lefton fire rescue horse and firefighter. Oh my word, this goes with the plastic stuff. Ugh, sun. <laughs> this little doggy, this adorable little doggy. And the last ceramic piece, this is also left in 1987. This little newsboy. So yeah, all of that for $3.99, rescue missions. And I th think that's it for the Savers Hall. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. And if you like these kinds of videos, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and become a permanent part of the Thrifty Divas family. We would love to have you. And we tend to have a lot of fun here. And also stay tuned because there's that other collective thrift haul coming right up. So until the next video, stay blessed, my friends. I love each and every one of you.